What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today I am doing a series of five kind of different headshots in an hour. So I thought I'd show you guys a setup. You guys watched a little time lapse from everything getting done. Show you guys what we got. I'm gonna time lapse the rest of the thing through and maybe talk at the end. If, if not, I won't. So let's check it out right now. What's up guys, it's Jeremy with Jeremy Lou Photography. Thank you so much for tuning in today. If you guys are new to the channel, please consider subscribing. If video helps you out in any way, give it a thumbs up, click that bell for notifications. It'll tell you every time I come on. Guys, uh, it's a pretty simple day. Uh, it's Monday after WPPI, and I have back-to-back -back headshots uh, within the studio that I'm at now. So if you notice, I'm in a different studio. I'm using Studio 14 in Reno. Uh, amazing friend of mine, Gina Hassler, opened up a studio, or Move Studios, but she's had this for a while, and I'm now I'm um, not a member, I'm an hourly rental person here. So I'm hourly renting things. You'll see a dinosaur back there. <laughs> Guys, I'm gonna show you the setup here. I have five different headshots, five people. Um, uh, some, some of them are the same company, but other of them are a different company. Um, I'm using a gray backdrop for everything. If I have to pull out later, I will, uh, as far as changing the color. But so far in all the emails, they, these are all corporate type headshots. So they all want the gray. And I can modify the gray a little bit with my lighting. Uh, I'm gonna show you the Strobus info that we're using here. So I'm shooting with a Sony A7 III. Uh, my settings are simple. I'm gonna adjust the lighting around it, but I'm shooting at F4, ISO 50, um, at 1 200th of a shutter. I'm using the Sony with a Sigma 135 millimeter, and that's my setup for today. I don't have to change anything. Um, I'm gonna be modifying the eye lighter here, depending on women, man, standing, sitting, whatever. Everybody's gonna be standing the whole time, but I wanna add a little bit of a glow. So let's go through what I'm actually using today for you guys. So first thing we're using, all the lights are, are Godox AD400, so I have a whole Godox series. In here, I have a couple AD200s and some speed lights from the Godox as well, so if I need to add lighting, I can. We're using Manfrotto tripods, and we have the Westcott eye lighter here. This is my favorite modifier for portraits ever. It's a Rotolux Elenchrome Deep Octa. I wanna say it's like 30, it's like the big one, like 43. And then on top of that, I'm still with Westcott here because this is pretty much everything. That's the only Ellen Cron thing that I have. But this is a Rapid Box Strip XL. Bowen's mount onto the AD400, just pops right on. Super easy. Um, no grid on these. I'm gonna I'm widen my light a little bit for all these shots, um, add a little bit. But I have two of these set up. And this is just Thunder Gray from Savage, which is my favorite go-to, super versatile. You can add a light to it. You can actually make it black, white, or gray, depending on how you light it. So fairly simple, I'm gonna be standing right about here, and this will kind of be my frame of shot, and we're gonna guide and guide through. So like I said, this is a simple shot. I'm going to be putting the uh, images at the end for you guys to see the final images whenever this does come out on YouTube. But I do wanna thank everybody for the support so far. My channel is growing, everything is going great, and I'm very, very excited. I've even joined TikTok, so if you guys are on TikTok, find me, and I'm doing a lot of BTS, a lot of little bit of things. I'm still trying to figure out how to use it within my ecosystem of, uh, of, of social media. <sighs> that was a quick setup. I, I got here late, I didn't have gas. I have like 12 miles left on my, my truck, but I wanted to make sure that I got here on time to get everything set up. It's different in a new studio because I have to set up every single time, whereas before I could leave my stuff in a corner and then just pull out and shoot. Um, but yeah, we'll do a little BTS. If you have some comments or questions, please leave them below. I'm gonna do a straight time lapse into photos. So this will be the last time you're hearing from me. Thank you guys so much. Enjoy.